Well, he transitioned to the other realm almost six decades ago, but some may say his contribution to Calypso remains unmatched to this day. The mighty spoiler was honored on Friday as theatre group Canboulet Productions unveiled a grand plaque at the gravesite of the late Calypsonian at the Woodbrook Cemetery on Mukarapa Road in St. James. This past week, the group presented the play A One of Fall, which delves into the life of the late Calypsonian. More in this report. Let us take the opportunity now, on behalf of the citizens of Trinidad and Tobago, and the creative arts fraternity, the Calypso fraternity, the music fraternity, everything, all our people, let us put this beautiful plan. Founder of Canboulet Productions, Roald Gibbons, who is also the playwright of the theater production, described the plaque as the implanting of a memory. So when the play goes, when the play is gone, it's over, there is something that is left. Meanwhile, Port of Spain Mayor Joel Martinez commended the effort, adding that it's now the collective task of all citizens to honor and promote our living cultural legends. We have too much at stake and uh, we are rich in history, we are rich in culture and that is what we have to sell. The Mighty Spoiler was born on March 23, 1926 and died on December 23, 1960. One of his most popular tunes to date is Bedbug, which was featured in the production. My brother said he want to come back a hog, but not spoiler. I want to be a bed bug, just yes, because I want to buy them young ladies' partner. Like a hot dog or a hamburger, and if you know your tin, don't be in a fright. It's only big fat women are going to buy. But would you like to be a yacht, Mr. Ross? He said he's big. 